to you all. My name is Richard Kraft, and for the last 50 years, I have studied and I am a disciple of the spiritual teacher and master, Omla Mikhail Ivanhoff, and the teaching of the Universal White Brotherhood. I have so much joy to share with you one of the subjects that I feel is the most important and essential of this teaching. The Master Omra Mikhail Ivanov has given his spiritual teaching in the goal of assisting all human beings in their spiritual evolution and in their path to achieve this extraordinary ideal that each one has deep within their hearts. This high ideal that we all have an origin in the divine world, that we're all cells of one cosmic being and that the goal of our lives is to allow this divinity to manifest within all our thoughts, within all our feelings, and within all our actions so that humanity will achieve this glorious, extraordinary, destination, the golden age, where there will be no more crime, no more devastation, no more illness, and each one will live in peace, harmony, in goodness, in kindness, in abundance, with each other and with the universe. So, this is a big subject. During his 50 years or 60 years of giving this spiritual teaching, the Master Omar Mikhail Ivanov covered every single facet of human beings' involvement in their incarnation and how can they connect to the divine world and bring this connection into their lives, into the choices that they're making, and to share this more fully with all human beings, with all of nature, with all the creatures around them for the greater good of all. So one of the themes that he mentions a great deal is that when we incarnate, we're all at school. We incarnate in the class of life. So he calls this the divine school of life. So this is what I would like to share with you today, is that each one of us, when we're born, we incarnate in a class to develop, to edify, to bring forth the lessons, the qualities, the abilities, the gifts that we have in each other, and to support the ones in each other. And he said, in this school, this divine school of life, there are three main branches. There's the school of love, the school of wisdom, and the school of truth. Today, I would like to share with you a bit about the school of love. So, I think the best way to enter into this subject of the School of Love is through the reading of one of the songs that we sing in the Universal White Brotherhood during the, the gatherings that we have. And this song was given by our teacher's teacher, the Master Pitudinov, 
who during his lifetime, when he was born, I think in 1864, till he passed away in, in 1944 or 1945, in that era, that he composed a great deal of spiritual melodies and words that were destined to connect every human being to their divine nature and to the universe in which we live in. So one of the songs that he wrote and gave is called, in Bulgarian, Bogelyubov, which means God is love. And I would like to share with you the lyrics of this song. And perhaps during this recording, you'll be able to hear the song, Bogelyubov sung by the choir of the Universal White Brotherhood. Boga you both. In English, God is love. Boga you both. Eternal, infinite, life-fulfilling love. The spirit is divine. It's the spirit of gentleness. The spirit of saintliness, so holiness. The spirit that fills our souls with peace and joy as we walk toward the light where divine love reigns. So, what's extraordinary in this school of love is right away we understand that God, the creation of all the universe, is love. That in everything that's created, since God is in everything that's created, is God's love. And we receive these qualities of what this love is in the description of this song. It's eternal. So this love is eternal. In other words, it's beyond anything we can possibly imagine of past, present, and future. It is eternal. It goes beyond what we consider linear time. And just a side note that I would imagine 
that in the teaching during these past, so 1937 to 18 to 1986, that's 50 years. 50 years of this teaching that the Master Omar Amikalaivinov gave, I would imagine that love is probably one of the most used words throughout this teaching. Why? Because the Master without stop always is supporting us, is encouraging us to see the creation through the eyes of God, to see his, her creation as a manifestation, as an expression of love, of divine love. So this is the first lesson that we learn constantly in the school of love through the teaching of the universal white brotherhood, that God is love. And this love is infinite and eternal. Infinite meaning its space has no limitations. And since we are a part of creation, since we live in God's creation, we also are infinite and we also are eternal. So our nature, our divine nature is love. And this divine nature is infinite and an eternal. So as we progress into this teaching, we are constantly reminded at all times that this is who we are, that we are a particle, we are a part of God, of God's creation, and this creation is infinite and eternal. Peace be also.